Still in Cebu, Cebu Governor Gwen Garcia wants to file criminal and administrative charges against local officials of the Public Works Department for a road project in Mandawa City that has remained unfinished since 2018. Cebu-based journalist Dale Israel gives us the details. Dale, go ahead. Sam, Cebu Governor Gwen Garcia says that the unfinished road project has caused tremendous inconvenience to Cebuanos. She also says it has caused economic losses due to the dilapidated state of the road, which is also the main access for those going to and coming from the Mactan Cebu International Airport. Garcia will seek authority from the provincial board on Monday to file charges against the regional and district officials of the DPWH, as well as ask local legislate, uh, legislators to declare them persona non grata. The governor will also talk with the mayors of Cebu City, Mandawi City, Lapu-Lapu uh, Lapu City to find out if there are other seemingly abandoned projects of the DPWH in their areas. She plans to file the cases at the Visayas Ombudsman next week. We are seeing Cebuanos suffer every day with needing to go through that, as of now, what seems to be a project that sees no end. And we are left in limbo while DPWH insists upon its position that it really wants to terminate the contract. The governor's eye stemmed from a series of meetings with still unnamed public works officials whom she claimed constantly lied to her on why the road project is still unfinished. Garcia would have wanted a compromise between the DPWH and the contractor BM Marketing that while they have pending case, the dilapidated road section should be temporarily paved and asphalted so as not to inconvenience motorists. Apparently, the road project has a pending court case. DPWH found out that its contractor, BM Marketing, allegedly presented falsified documents during bidding. The project was supposed to be finished by 2020. Now, Sam, we are still trying to get in touch with DPWH and BM while the case is pending. DPWH Central Visayas Office says they already sought budget from the central office to do the temporary asphalting for the 100-meter section of UN Avenue. Now, capital lawyers say that even the contractor, BM Marketing, volunteered to fix the road but was not given permission by the DPWH. Back to you, Sam. Dale Israel there reporting.